Hello, this is Coach Lydia Knight, and we are ending eating disorders and freeing women from every cage. And freedom is never again having to evaluate the damage done. So, you know, in those movies, there's a lot of movies with this plot line where it's like, the plane crashes in the jungle, and then everyone's waking up from being knocked out in the plane, and then they have to evaluate the damage. They have to be like, what is the damage to the plane? How many people have we lost? How many people died? How many people injured? What supplies do we have left? So this horrible, horrific thing happens, and then there's the scene where they evaluate the damage. And when we are in a struggle with food, we have that feeling every time after we binge. It's the next morning waking up and the inflammation is making your joints ache and you have a headache and you're dehydrated and you're still full from the night before and you feel gross and you feel all the shame. And then there's the scene where you evaluate the damage. What did I do? How many calories did I eat? What did I put myself in risk of? How much did I just waste financially on that binge? What is the risk of people who could have seen me or found out? What does this mean for my kids that were in the same room or could have been seeing me? What does this mean for the events that I can't go to now because now I feel too awful to go out and face any, everyone? Like, wh how, what is the damage to my emotional state of what I can and can't do? Or how does this impact my work? How does it impact my relationship? There's just all of this evaluating of like, I can't believe I did that again. And what is the damage done? And then the uphill battle of trying to undo all that damage, of trying to just get back to that baseline of I'm finally to a place where I can start over again, trying to make this better because I've finally undone the damage. And freedom is never again in your life having to evaluate the damage of a binge because you don't do that anymore. You don't binge anymore. Food is not a struggle. That's freedom, where you're not worried about having to do that again because it's a non-issue, because you don't need to do that again. So for your next step to freedom, go to lifewithlydia.com.